guys, how's it going? Jay Roach here. We're going to jump into some Paragon action today. We are going to be playing my brand new Sparrow deck. I actually just created it here a few minutes ago, uh, and I'm interested to see how it plays out with this new meta with minions, and just see how overall how well it's going to play. It's a little bit less in the physical armor and uh, energy armor, more damage, and some health interline with a little bit of attack speed. We're playing a crit attack speed damage just to see how high we can hit with her. Um, we're gonna have to play very, very cautious at first before we get our blink charm. Yeah, that's, uh, I said it right. We got a blink charm in, in this deck. It looks like our uh, Q time here, so we'll pull this up real quick and just kind of briefly show you what's apart. We're gonna ready up. You can see what kind of is in here right now. Alright, are we going to queue in? Queue in? There we go. Alright, so early on, let's throw in Sparrow. Ranger, any lane. Hopefully we can get her. No Murdoch would be great though. But, yeah, there we go. No, no Murdoch. Yeah, Gideon. Team comp here looks alright, except for the fact that we're, I mean, energy damage is great here. Energy damage is great there. Oh, support. I mean... Hopefully Greystone will be our tanky guy. That's what we're going to look for. We're going to really depend on hugging the towers in this match and being around our tanks. Any question for more to steal? I mean, yeah. I would have liked to see this bad homie right here, but it is what it is. Harassment is not a normal part of the game. Stay positive. So it'll be some time. All right, guys, let's get started here. We're gonna start off. This is my Sparrow number two deck, not the number one. You can see damage is pretty high on this one. We're gonna Sparrow number two. We're gonna confirm this in. We're going to start out with a health potion, health token, and a strike token. Only because I do not have the second strike token unlocked yet, apparently the card gods hate me. And just for the sake... Oh, let's, let's go left lane. Oh, never mind, let's go right lane. Just for the sake... Uh, no, I want left lane. Let's see if I can... I want, yeah, Murdoch should be right lane. Gideon should have his own lane. I'm gonna take left lane. I'm gonna start off with the E ability. Um, you can go with Q. If you really feel that your, uh, your minion clear isn't working out that well for you, but I feel that I level up pretty easily here. We're just gonna just keep our hits going. Always be shooting. Always be shooting, guys. Start out just farming. Stay back. There's no need to get aggressive. Try to last it, but the best we can. Keep our stacks going. Maybe we can get this guy from behind here. That's perfect. Not get the last hit. We'll put that right in the queue. That was a bad move on his part. Let's make it happen. Forever ganked. Oh no. Heal up. Sucks we can't get him. With 
that uh, little extra strike token next time. We should be able to make it happen. There we go. Way to be, baby. Way to be. We're going to run back. Just chill here for a second. And wait. I really don't want to be up here. I really don't. Especially this early on. No, I can't attack left lane. I'm too weak. I'm just gonna let him happen, come all the way back. Try to play it up to here. As of right now, it's just gonna be maintaining proper distance and trying to farm our last hits. If he wants to test us, we can test him. Just pop shot in him away. He thinks he's a lot tougher than he is. We're going to go into the right click now. For those long distance shots. Take the last hits like it's our job, guys. Whoa. Missed that one. Oh, I need to... I really wish he wasn't in my lane. I don't like this at all. Yeah, we're gonna get out of here. He doesn't know what he's doing. We're really relating with a guy who doesn't seem like he knows what's going on. He got himself killed by the tower and the minions. Oh, good lord. Wow. Boom. Now we're back. We have a pretty good wave here. Zoom in, hold for a few seconds. It's a good farming tool. Pop that all. Keep pegging them away. Wow. Oh, we just missed him. Eat another healing potion. Keep ourselves out here in the lane. Oh, that should have been the last hit for us. Just let it keep going around. No rush here. Wow, it's not that quick. Missing the last hits too much, too often. I don't like being here, but we do have Chimera on our side. So, if we do need help, throw it into the E. It's always your best bet. Again, we don't need to be running up. He's still level 4. So we're not afraid of him yet. Um, if you guys don't know anything about Greystone, Greystone at level 5 right there, he just got it. He got his ultimate. So he can revive. He pretty much gets a second life. Yeah, it's only at 50%. But just, yeah, that's 50%. He's going to try to charge me here. I probably could be pop shotting him for some damage. right there but he's gonna run away he's gonna escape good job on Chimera for pushing him notify to be right back and we're gonna go into the card buying process uh, depending on what you prefer I prefer to go into the brawlers ward and this time it looks like I want to go in the aspect of Heart of the Apex. Enemy tower destroyed. 
Um, what is going on, mid lane? Guys, we are not playing with the smartest of team right now. Like, we're letting them just get to our second tier tower. We can probably walk them down. Got him! Woohoo! That's the way we do it. Good old Sparrow walk down. Good old Sparrow walk down, guys. Last hit. We added a tiny bit of damage. We shouldn't have to do this already, but we're at second lever tower. Amir needs help over there, but Gideon, not Gideon, Murdoch's on his way. Last hits. More last hit. Oh, they didn't give us it. Keep doing this. We'll throw another ward out there. Keep our eyes wide. Listen for that ping. Got the last hit again. Finish the E out. That way we're just dealing damage like it's going on the style. I could rotate left lane and help him take that. But. Should be alright over there. Cool. We might be able to take all oh, the other chimeras behind. See if we can take the tower with our friends here, the minions. It's gonna cut it close. Real close. Let's see what we can do. Oh, our reticle went away. I've been having that issue uh, now and again. Last hit, last hit. <laughs> that was real close. We're using our ultimate to clear minions. Let's back up. Oh, he just got us. We really overplayed that one. Oh. Yeah, that was greed. The greed got us. That's what we didn't want to do. Don't do that. Okay, so we've got six points. Um, the fully upgraded bonus here is what we're going to need soon enough. Um, but right now, we really need to play into our strong suit, which is healing some damage. Uh, Sparrow's really good, in my opinion, at getting CXP fairly quickly. Especially in between 8 and 12. It's uh, when we should start to be able to upgrade our Q and right click abilities fairly well. As well as our ultimate. And kind of like Twin Blast, your ultimate starts as like a lane clear. Or it really helps as a lane clear, I should say. It does do some potential damage later on. Uh, it just takes a little bit. But I do like it as a... I like it as a late game lane clear, clear, especially if you're looking at an inhibitor down. You can push super minions away super, yeah, very easily, extremely easily. Got him there. Pop this ult. Clear the lane. And we'll even up our ultimate right now. We might not have had to go that crazy. But. We're doing a good job of pushing these guys back. Use the ult to get out of here. So Muriel ulted. 
to go help out right lane. Look at that. Rain hail arrows from above. Oh, a little slow. It's always good to have these wards. We probably shouldn't be this far up, but it looks like Murdoch is just super pushy right now. Hold, 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 and boom, fire. They took right lane, but I mean, it's a tier one tower at this point. We're down to their tier twos. I'm gonna put another ward out, hopefully saving us from utter destruction. I'm doing exactly what I said I didn't want to do. And that's, yep, 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 get caught. Looks like we're lagging a little bit here too. We're lagging quite a bit, guys. Yeah, we're doing nothing. <coughs> Should've known better. Should've dipped away. Should've, would've, could've. Alright, so we go into damage, or we can go into the wind carver. Let's see what we have on deck here. Could also go into building crit right now if we wanted to. Instead of attack speed. So I'm actually going to finish out this. Give ourselves some health. The reason we're going to do that is because we noticed that uh, we do need the health. So we're up to 400. And early game for us ish right now is still early. Should be well. Um, we're doing alright. We're 2-2-1. Two, two, and one. So we're not overly feeding the Sparrow. We already have two kills early. And we only get better, guys. We only get better as the game goes on. If anybody's ever played Sparrow before, you know that she is a beast to deal with late game. And the hope is that late game here, we're going to be doing enough attack speed and crit, as well as a little bit of penetration to get through any continuous tank builds we're seeing here. So we're going to upgrade the right click so we keep it equal and slowly move in. Oh, what are we doing here? Chimera thinks you can tank all these guys out. I guess so. Oh, we might get stuck. We might get stuck. Back up, back up, back up. Kite, 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 kite. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Retreat, retreat, retreat. Whew. Okay, I should have really trusted uh, Chimera there, and we went in a little bit earlier with him. If this Murdoch stays, we're taking him. We had to pop him just to annoy him. We really had to do that. I like this action right now, guys. Let's let's just drop a ward, just just in case we don't want Chimera coming up behind us. Continue our hits. Just keep popping Muriel real hard. Oh, he dropped down. Murdoch got his own life saved. Murdoch got his own life saved. So I didn't hold that for the full count, which I really should have. It could have done some more damage. But in this case, I was really just looking to peck. Do as much damage as I can to this Mur or this Grux over here. He's going to hit us with this. He's going to try really hard to stay alive. And we got shot from across the map. Uh, why offensive maneuvers, you ask? It's because it gives you both physical and energy armor pretty early on right now. Like, it's nice to have. That sucks about that left lane. So, we did a pretty job of wiping their team down. We're hitting for a lot more, if you haven't noticed now. What is going on in the jungle? It's like a rock'em sock'em robots of chimeras here. 
I don't know that he's doing much help. Got him. I don't know if he just doesn't know what he's doing. But he's really not helping out. Okay, um... I'm gonna go with the Q, just to help this. Uh, this Murdoch over here is really not my favorite. 1,000, 2, 1,000, wow! Last hits, last hits, last hits! Come on. Let's put up a ward. I think it's a smart thing to have up wards. At all times, as Sparrow. You should never not have a ward up. I could probably get out of here. Go help middle. I really... Oh, I, saying, I really don't know why they're having such a hard time right now. Nope, 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 nope. We need to remove ourselves from that situation and enter at a better point. Especially, especially, a Sparrow. I've got mid. Hope we can pop him back here. Let's just keep hulking away. Probably a bad alt, just to say. We need to clear minion waves. Relatively fast. I'm gonna go with the right click. Again, keeping it even at this point in time. There's no need to get overly crazy. Uh, we're chasing kills, it looks like, over there. I don't really know why. Wow, Gideon took a lot of last hits. We have nine points to spend. Um, I would normally say let's go back. I don't see the enemy team anywhere. There they are. We need to retreat. Wow. Bye, bye Woo! Back up, back up, back up. Run, 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 run. Saving lives. Oh my Jesus. Oh, we were saved by Saint Gideon. Praise be to Saint Gideon, guys. Saved our lives. Which is what we need as a Sparrow character in here. Alright, so we have nine points to spend. This is when we can start getting a little creative here. I need to fill this out, giving us that. And I'm gonna start to fill out our crit. So now we have a full 50% crit bonus here. We have a 24% crit chance stacked. We're doing pretty well. So next we're gonna be building into, looks like attack and attack speed. Because we're staying positive, which is a four and three. Three deaths, honestly, for Sparrow is not bad. I'm going to go left lane, and hopefully we can take some guys out here. I'm close enough to the inhibitor. They think they're going to get a free shot. We've got Gideon, or we got Murdoch here that thinks he's a lane clear. We're going to pop our ultimate. The reticle disappeared again. That's an issue. Bye. 
It was nice knowing you. Let's get back to our tower. We know our tower's our friend. So we're hitting pretty hard there. And that wasn't even a full upgrade on our ultimate, which we just fully upgraded there at the end. So you should have a fully upgraded ultimate, a fully upgraded E, and then you should have your Q and your right-click abilities at at least three to four upgrades already. I have three more points to spend. I'm at 36 CXP, and I'm at level 13 for the regular experience. We will continue to push. Um, we don't have enough people to attack mid lane, to be honest. We could probably do some help and some damage in there, but it looks like you're 2v2, which should be fine. So they have one down, we have, I mean, there we go. We might have the advantage now if we come in. Wow. We just crit for 250 there. <coughs> This is insane. Let's see what we can do on this. Two fifty. Let's remove ourselves from the situation. We will return. I was considering taking black buff. We're grouping up, we're grouping up. We're gonna go hit mid. We're gonna hopefully ignore these guys. They're coming up with a big wave. Let them know that we need help. Pop the ult, because Greystone doesn't know where to go. Getting some damage in here. We probably need to exit the building unless he's got an ult. He does not have his ultimate. We need to exit the building promptly. That way we're not going to get killed. We're gonna exit stage right. Get back to where we need to be. They can follow all they want. We have a tower to save us. They have no minion waves. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. You die. No! Got him! Run away! Run away! Don't leap on me! Woohoo! Wow. That was a rough start. Defend. Left lane. One, one thousand, two, one thousand. Pop shot! Lane clear. Lane clear. See what I mean, guys? Use your ultimate, get the lane clear on. Yeah, I've got it. Just keep pegging her. She's not gonna do much damage to us, but. Wow. All right, we're going to go back, and we're going to finish out getting ourselves the unique passive, getting ourselves the full crit, 
Looks like we have seven points to spend here. We can go into... We could probably get our Blink Charm. So we will remove this, put our Blink Charm. Oh, that sucks. Cannot do our Blink Charm yet. So we're going to go into, I think we should go into our Wind Carver Blade. Just for funsies. And then play into Major Kinetic Strike. That's what we're going to try. Like I said guys, this is a little bit of a trial by fire right now. I've got six and three with two assists. We're gonna work on some more in the left lane right now, just because I know I've got a couple guys coming over here. So we'll drop that bomb on them. We're hitting pretty hard. We do need to back up. Keep pegging them. Keep pegging them. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. We're going to heal up. Continue to count our kills. Like a sniper. There we go. Okay, now we have a legit reason to go back, especially with this low... Nope, defend right lane. We're gonna lose it. Oh my gosh. There's nothing I can do right now. Alright, so... What we need to do is attack right lane. We have three points. We're gonna finish. We're going to discard. We are going to put in. What does it give me? A buff, a fully upgraded bonus. Hmm. Probably should have left that damage there. But we're gonna go with two. Then we're going to remove the health potion, and then we will play for the next turn. I probably should have kept the health potion. We're honestly just playing for this next three points to get the six to go back to get the blink charm. We really need something to escape. Retreat, retreat, retreat. We got this. We lost two in Hibs. Alright. See what's going on here. This is kind of what I think we should do. Is attack all the way through. 
They have super minions. We have super minions. We really should probably be attacking. Oh, wow. Yeah. We just need to cause some major damage, get our points up. Hail of arrows back on it again. Hit the minions. Another wave of minions coming in. Let's just stack our points if we can. Radical disappeared. Fire it anyway. We need the damage. They're trying to attack mid. So we're going to come over here and hope to defend it. I don't know how many of those he gets in like a cooldown period. Jeez, I can't be far enough away from the guy. Well, we're back. Let's see what we can do. Let's go over here. kills and nothing more we can do about it really trying to push these guys out of here so we can just continue to live I mean, we're doing all right here. We're hitting for 293. We're not at full build. Got him. Sparrow walk down, baby. One, two, three, draw. Wow, I'm hitting for a lot. I'm melting down their, their abilities right now. Give me the ability to farm some. Keep running away, keep running away. Run, 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 run. We are so close to having the full build. So we're gonna come up here, 
we're going to play into our blink char I mean we really don't need to actually honestly we're gonna play into here and finish this out there and we're gonna go oh we got it blink charm we're off by three points. Wow. Our card match was not good on this one, guys. I mean, I did all right, I guess. Walk him down. Nice. We have to get out of that one. Wow, we need our ult. We need to clear this. But it's okay, guys, because we're going out fighting. Snuck up behind me, Gavin. It's over. I don't know how we're doing this. I mean, we've effectively the only reason we're doing this is because we murdered their whole team. We can team fight really, really well because nobody does like. Ni Take her down. Get that Grux. Hit him in the face. He's dead. Dead. Oh, the red buff disappeared on us. Yeah, it's dead. Let him have it. Put a put a ward down at the end. Oh well, guys. Wasn't what we wanted, and we would have liked to win there. But you know, you only can do what you uh, can do, man. You only can do so much for your team. And in this case, we had a Murdoch that died well over 20 times. I'm gonna say now, by the end of it, oh, almost 20 times. We went 11 and six, and six. So. That's all right. We had the number one kills. I would have liked to see a little less deaths, but at the end there, man, it, like, I was at what eleven and three is what we probably would have looked at without that massive killing spree at the end with everybody. It is what it is. We we got up to sixty. You can see here you have a Gideon with thirty three points and only eight spent, <clears throat> which means he did not know what he was doing. Um, you had everybody else was relatively good. We had everybody is decent here, but. It was easily beatable. Muriel wasn't the 60 card points. Their Chimera, which is crazy, wasn't the 60 card points. This Grox, who had a decent amount of kills, we were eating him alive. We were just pop, 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 done. So, 
We're going to rate that he was completely mismatched. We're going to put you as a team player, because you were. You were a very good team player. I didn't work with you, but I'm going to say that you're a team player. So, thanks guys for tuning in. Uh, that was our run-through of our new Sparrow deck. Obviously, we're going to take a little couple tweaks to it. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, you just want to talk a little bit, feel free to put them in the comments section. I'll get to them as soon as possible. Uh, don't forget to subscribe or like. Yeah. Have a great day, guys.